Welcome back to a, what might be the worst episode of Grimes Finds that you have ever seen. <laughs> Gina let me spend $2,700 on a 10 by 10, y'all. Not only a 10 by 10, y'all see it was a manager unit. Normally, you know, I do not bid on private units. I do not bid on manager units, but I had a suspicion about this one and my yeah. suspicions turned out to be right. So while me and Gina get out and get this door popped open, check out this phone call of why I actually paid $2,700 on a manager unit. Hey, good morning. How are you doing? I'm good. How are you? Good. Hey, I just had a quick question about uh, one of the auctions you have today that I, I had bid on earlier. Mm -hmm. uh, it's auction ID one, uh, 136 3865. Um, and I, I, I may have missed it just, but I usually don't bid on uh, non lean manager units. Did that get changed to a manager unit? No. Um, this has. Been on the manager special for a week, I believe. Oh. Um, there's one hour or two of a deadline. Um, yeah, all, all that was with that unit. Um, the person got placed into um, a nursing home, and they unfortunately just had to, um, they decided to give their items to extra space, and that was it. Oh, that makes a lot of sense. Okay. Okay. Well, that makes sense. So all that stuff in there be did belong to that one person. I guess they just gave up the unit. Yeah, it, and it's sad because I just speak to that person, and it's they're pretty much their their hobbies, what they dedicate themselves to, and um, it's very much organized. It's well put together. There's a lot of items in there. Okay, um, that's sad. Is yeah, there personal stuff still in there that they'll need back? No. Um, what they had done when when the tenant, um, you know, decides to give extra space their items. Uh -huh. um, they have the opportunity, you know, to access their unit however they want. 
Sure. Um, before they left the property, that's when they came in, gave us the keys, and said, you know, I'm signing this on over to you guys. After that, we only, only thing we do is open the doors, take pictures, lock it up, secure it. Man, y'all are awesome. I love extra space. Okay, that makes a lot of sense. Okay, well then, um, all right, then I feel comfortable still bidding on it. So I appreciate it so much. You're actually the third person today that's called and, and asked about it. Well, because it looks, you know, it's, I do this for a living. And you just get to looking at some of the units sometimes, and it didn't look like it had been rummaged through. And so, you know, and it, sometimes you got a lot of these properties, they'll they'll do that, and they'll like, you'll go in there, it'll be empty boxes or just boxes of trash. And so... Um, well, I wasn't allowed to step in there and see any further, but from my view and the picture that we took, it's very well organized. It is, right? yeah, that's why... I've that person's <laughs> been here for years. Okay, that makes sense. Okay, well, all right, well, uh, I might see you this afternoon. All right. Thank you, ma'am. Hold on. All right, guys. So I'm super nervous about this. So like I said, Gina, actually, I was about to back out at 2300 I said, you know, I just don't want to spend that much on that unit. And she's like, oh, yeah, but what if it's this and what if it's that? And I was like, fine, I'll go higher. <laughs> That's not what I said. I said, what if they know something that we Yeah, but know? you were encouraging me to spend more, y'all. <laughs> she encouraged me. So look, anything we don't make over 2300 is her fault, y'all. Secondly, I was gonna introduce you to a new channel. Is actually why I was zeroing in on this. We're gonna introduce you to a new fishing channel. Uh, not in this video, but maybe in one of the videos coming up. Maybe we'll be able to take the fishing stuff that I saw in here and sell it to them and you guys can meet them. But without further ado, y'all, I am so freaking nervous about this unit. They didn't touch anything. Let me pop it open. Let's show you why I spent $2,700. You ready? I'm filming oh my already. God. I'm already nervous, y'all. Yeah. All right, so look, I'm going to show you a few things why I, why I bought it because she said it was this hobby stuff. I saw this. This looks like it might be some kind of floating like fishing device or yeah. something. I saw the camouflage here. Okay, this is what I saw that really made me bid on it. Y'all know how it, Look at that, babe, already. Yep. Look, gotcha. this is one of the reasons why I bought it is because ammo is so freaking expensive right now. And I saw that. I saw that Winchester box. Oh my gosh, babe, look. Oh look at that. Gosh. That's all ammo. It's all ammo. And look, a gun case. Yep. Okay, so look, I saw that. And then way back there, you see all the fish and tackle boxes. The pictures were horrible. You couldn't see that. Oh, those are fishing pole cases. They are. Babe, That's this is nice more gun then. cases right here. You yep. think there's any guns in here? I. I actually think there could be guns in here. With all the ammo in there, there mm -hmm. might be y'all. So this person went to a nursing home. Oh my gosh, y'all. Should we check one gun case? I don't know. You want to leave the, I always need a the dolly. All right, guys, so look, y'all know the dang deal. Okay, so look, oh my gosh, those are all gun cases. Look, there's nice fishing poles back here. Yeah. Okay, look, this is all fishing lures. Look, let's just, let's test one, see what's in here. Okay, so it did, it looked like camping stuff, but the reason why I did bid on it was because of the ammo boxes. I was yeah. hoping that there was gonna be ammo in here because it could be a thousand dollars in ammo alone. I mean, there is a lot of stuff in here. I'm like, is that a gun? <laughs> what is this? Oh, look. Oh, it's still nice. Oh, oh and these, there these, I, cool look, oh, I bid on it too because I saw these. These look like art boxes. They do. Okay, I don't know if there's art in that, but look, these are nice chairs. All these coolers up here, there's tubs. I gotta put my glasses on. I can't even see this, y'all. I'm freaking out right now, because hopefully that, okay, there's something in that. Okay, it looks like camping stuff. Yeah. Uh, this said, I'm all over the place. You are. <laughs> oh, I saw this, it said Bose. I was hoping this Bose thing was in here, because, you know, that could be a hundred bucks or so. Yeah. There's Sony stuff. All right, guys, so I don't know. Let me get my glasses. I don't know, man. All right, look, so the first one's empty. You think there's anything in any of these? I bet they might have taken them, but I don't know. There could be a gun hidden in here somewhere. What's that say? Fish camping? Oh, look, knives. A bag of filet knives. Oh, well, it's not all knives. Yeah, okay, so I'm already not as nervous about this unit but let me get my glasses on and i think we're gonna pull the ammo out first let's pull the truck up all right let's see. Let's go ahead and grab our ammo 
All right, guys, so look, we're gonna start with all the ammo. Let me grab all the boxes that say ammo, and then we'll kind of go from there. Leave me your comments down, or leave a comment down in there. This feels full, it's not even open. All right, look, okay, more shotgun shells, 20 gauge. Okay, so we got two boxes of ammo. Y'all know ammo is so freaking expensive right now. Oh, we got Remington shells. Okay, oh, shotgun there. shells. Yeah. So, I wonder how much these were. You know, I don't really mess around with shotguns. I just don't like them. Um, so I don't know what these go for. If you know what these boxes go for, let me down. Let me know down in the comments. Look, this whole thing. See, this is what I was kind of afraid of. Huh? Oh, I don't know. Maybe that actually is in there. It feels kind of light. Yeah. I was like, maybe it's going to be a bunch of empty boxes and stuff. Hey, old people do keep a lot of boxes. They do. I've noticed. So, let's look in here. Oh, no, it's in there. It is? Yeah, it's in there. Cool. Okay, so whatever this is, mosquito repellent. Oh, yeah, this is the stuff that goes in it. It's some kind of mosquito repellent thing. Oh. For when you're cool. fishing, and those are like refills for it. Okay, so we got this. Box out. Maybe those are, oh, man. That's a lot of ammo, yo. <laughs> that is a lot of ammo. Oh, my goodness. You think about like $50 a box? I don't know on shotgun shells. Maybe not. You know? Maybe not that much. No, nah, maybe 15, 20. I don't 15 know. 15 to 20. Oh. But I don't know. Look, this said wedding gift on it. Uh, what's it say? Tall pictures. Um, we're not gonna mess with the gun cases right now. Let's finish this shelf. Okay, this is some kind of wreath. Okay. I am curious if this is in here. This it feels light. What if? It's what if they got me? What if they just put red felt, something large plus, smaller? Okay, so look, that's not what's in here. That doesn't mean it can it doesn't mean it's not what's good. in there, but there's something felt, but I don't have my knife on me. And y'all go leave your comments down and tell me how stupid I am. What's the wedding gift? Okay, there's got to be a knife in here, right? Yeah. Oh, what is this? A hatchet? Oh, look, it is. It's like a saw. Oh, See, this is a good sellable item yeah, right here. Good. Okay, I'm gonna borrow this shank. <laughs> borrow the shank. Actually, I need to get that fillet knife. So, yeah, I definitely, you know, hopefully this isn't all Christmas stuff, but stuff like this sells. Oh, yeah, it sells really it's well. It's easy to sell, it's easy uh -huh. auction items. Let's see what the Christmas gifts were. Okay, yeah, that's weird. Well, there's some, oh, it's like there's a stand in here. Oh. And I don't know what these are for, but okay. I mean, at least it's sellable. Kind of cool though. Yeah. Yeah. It's like maybe a spice rack or something like that. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Okay. Let's see if this is what this is, because this looks very nice. It's a like a, a portable car charger. I'm like yeah. looking around. I'm trying to count my money up real fast, y'all. I'm a little <laughs> nervous. Okay, y'all, look. It's nice. Yeah, it's in there. Yeah. Look, it's even got a new little uh, uh, air checky thingy in it. So, all right, so we've probably, we made a little bit of our money back so far. Yeah. Right here. Okay. Ammo, ammo, ammo. This looks like, that looks like where they were cleaning the personal stuff out. Yeah. Uh, sorry, I just want to peek over here. There's toolboxes down here. Nice toolboxes. This looks like it's all tools. Um, let's see what these are. Yeah, look, there's nice camo packs, oh, water yeah, those clubs. Are sell well. Yeah, there's some good packs here. Oh, this got, got something in it. Probably more bags. This is a pop up tent, it looks like. I was thinking this is one of those floaty things. Like emergency things? No, that you fish in. They sit uh, in and you fish. Uh -huh. Oh, look at this. So there's some hunting gear in here, some gloves. Everything's nice and packed. Very nicely. You know what? I'm, I'm not concerned anymore. Yeah, think, I'm not concerned either. I think it'll be a good money maker. Look, for tools, us. tools. Uh, I mean, these chairs are nice. There's big coolers. I'll probably sell those on Facebook. Yeah. All right, before we go into any more boxes, because it looks like we're getting good sellable stuff in the boxes, yeah. I want to kind of get back here and peek at the hunting stuff and the fishing stuff. Because, like I said, I just met someone, well, kind of messaged through messaging and stuff that might want this stuff. So let's get these, all this stuff out of the way and then we'll take a peekies at the fishing stuff. 
Fishing lures. We might have a couple of G's and fishing lures. I know, it's not fishing lures. Y'all look, it's we really might nice. have a couple thousand dollars in fishing stuff. Look. Lures. Look at this. Lures. Look at this. This thing is packed. That is heavy sucker right there. And the thing is, it's not nasty. Normally you find this stuff, it is so nasty because they didn't take care of it. Look, big lures. Big lures. Uh, lures. Dang, y'all. I ain't worried no more. Look at all this stuff. What? Look at all this fishing stuff. I know. Look, we got fillet knives. Uh, electric uh, weighers. Look at these. We're going to have other kind of knives. Uh, let's look to remove the hooks. Whoa. Y'all, we might have like 5G's of fishing stuff in here. <laughs> might have to have a big old... Look at this, babe. Y'all fishermen, hey, all you people that came from Lunkers, let me know what I'm looking at right here because, I mean, I've been fishing my whole life. But, like, even look at this stuff. New. Fish call. <laughs> um, man, look at all this stuff, babe. So, y'all let me know. All you guys that came from Lunkers, let me know uh how much keep me a tally going and this is going to be a couple videos probably two but let me know when you think i've hit my 2600 bucks in fishing stuff um when i piece it out and i'll do a big auction or i'll see if somebody's interested in buying this stuff we might have more fishing stuff because there's a little sticker here so let's get this out Yeah, buddy. Let's see. Yep, look. More fishing stuff. Look, brand new stuff in here. Blades. More knives. Man, he Lures. Nice, he? Yeah, he did. Uh, let's see what's in here. I feel like everybody had that. Like that yeah, boy, look. We got uh, uh, reels. Oh, awesome. Reels in here. Look, I'll have to look these up. I don't know what these are worth. Uh, one of the units I saw in... Look, these are all new. I think these are all new. Like new old stock. Still in the bubble wrap. Yep. Okay, what else? Got a little thermometer. Let's see what else we got here. Trash bags. Look, man. A little thing to scoop <laughs> stuff. All right, y'all. So, hey, what y'all think? All right, I'm gonna get these ladders out. Man, I hope these freaking fishing poles are in here. I know. Look, this looks like more lures. Okay, there's definitely stuff in here. Yeah. Okay, there's definitely, look at this. I know this isn't an expensive reel because I, I looked this one up uh, online because I could clearly see it. Oh my God, babe, these are all fishing reels. Are they really? All fishing reels. Oh <laughs> okay, so look at this. All right, let's take this to the truck. All right, let's see. So I'm gonna look these up individually in a little bit. Yeah, I'm gonna put all, unless somebody buys this from me, all look, all in here. Okay. We got one, two, three. Let's just keep saying through the same. He kept good care of his stuff, look. It's in there. I mean, that's been used. It's got line in it, but it's in very nice shape. Yeah. All this stuff's super clean. And you can tell, guys, a lot of times, I figure out how much I'm gonna spend by like how organized the unit is. But look, that's in there. Okay. This is in here, that's in here. That's in there. And look, they're in very look, very clean. And yeah. he kept the pamphlets and everything. Oh, that's awesome. So right now we've got man, I don't know. We might have our money back because I, mean, I don't I, know about the lures. That's what I was thinking too. <laughs> Alright guys, so look, here's more lures, lures. Lures, what am I talking about? Reels. <laughs> Reels. Look at this. Okay, we got more. So let's look. Here's that bucket. He's got them all in here. What's that say? Heading 284. Man, I remember these big bad boys. That's a Zebco. Um, so, I mean, those are probably, I don't know why he didn't put those in boxes. Alright, so I'm going to start kind of this stuff up here. Dub decoys. Uh, same thing. Looks like some decoys. Uh, I don't know. I'm going to see what's in that. Uh, let's see. Okay, I'm going to go through these. So these are all little empty ones. Okay, and they're very nice. Those are nice. Okay, we'll put those up there. 
Here's what we got here. A little, little wine, wine yeah, opener. Wine you gotta sorry. have that. Oh, opener. I said something. <laughs> uh, let's see. Weights. You know, nice little case. All this stuff's yeah. clean. This stuff's super clean. Um, let me show you these. Here, let's take these out here. Okay, look. These all look to be in fairly decent shape. Berkeley. Here, let's show them. So look at all these. That's a Berkeley. I'm not familiar with a lot of this stuff. Shakespeare. Um, but I mean, they're all in really good condition. Um, so what? That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I mean, we got we can match them up with lure or reels too. Let's see. Look, just more nice, clean stuff. Yep. Okay. Uh, before we go through any more of that, that's cool. Look, that stuff feels really heavy. Um, what's in here? Hey man, what's in there? Um, oh look at this nice radio. Look at this old Sony sports radio. It's oh, really nice. Fun. Yeah. Um, this says, I think it said prints on it. Fez oh baby, these are duck prints. I know, that's what I was saying. If they're duck prints, we might, really we might be really in big money because uh, duck prints. All right, so I know I got good fish and stuff. I wonder what's in that big thing. Who knows? It's like a big cooler or something. It is. Here, don't pee. Yo, look how. Oh, look at it. Is this a minnow tank? Oh, is it? Huh. It might be. I don't know. Right, guys. Can you read what this says? Where? Okay, right here. Andrew White, Lang Bang, Lang Bang, Sailboats. All right, let me just get this open. Let's see. Oh, yeah. Please be with. Now, these are. we. I'm serious, y'all. Look at this baby and the sign. It's ducks. 89 duck stuff. 12 of 150. Yep, that stuff can be really good. Y'all, this stuff, like we know this stuff, mm. this stuff can be big, big money. And if he's got duck stamps and stuff in here. Duck stamps. Duck stamps. We're in the money. We are in the money. Woo. Glad I didn't let you talk me out of this one. Hey, I talked you into it. Oh, now you want to say you did. Yeah, look. <laughs> look, here's the stamps, numbered yep. and signed. COA, COA in the back, boy. Y'all, there's like one. Look at all these boxes. Look, look at all those boxes. If those are all prints, y'all. Look at all those. Look, this is signed. Y'all, we could have like $50,000 worth of art in here. Oh my gosh, babe. Look at these. You pumped now, eh? Oh, I am. I'm so excited. Boy, y'all, I'm telling you, I'm I've made big day. money on duck prints and stamps. Uh-huh. Look at these. Okay, got a little quail action. All right, let's get this stuff in the truck. I'm going to pop another one of these open. All right, guys. Uh, so, look, this is bubble wrapped up. They all got COAs on the back. That's so awesome. All right, I'm gonna I don't want to take all these out because we got to transport these home. Look, an owl. It's signed. 190 of 500 and it's got a coa on the back baby hey guys we got company we gotta go <laughs> that's her i was joking kind of all right so, okay, there's no coa on the back of this one but it's signed oh look it's blue jays about to freaking jump an owl but look right here 190 of 500 y'all all right guys so I'm not gonna. Well, I am taking all this home. Um, so look, oil ships. Oil, yeah, ships, ship, oil paintings oil and ships. Paintings. Look, top. Yeah. Methodist. Resolution Hospital editorials. William something wood do a decoy prints. Yes. That's what we want, baby. Indeed. That's what we want. And look how big these boxes are. Uh, Ducks and fly, y'all. Two pictures. Okay, so look, but look, what is this? Look at this wood. It's like a case that says something. It's got an address on the side. Uh, what if this is all prints? That would be great. Let's try to get this out. Okay. All right, how do you open this bad boy? How does this thing... Oh, does this... Oh, no. I think it... Does it pick up? Let's see. Do you see a... 
Is it it's screwed shut? It is screwed shut. Yo. Still got company. They're like right there. They keep trying to peep my heart, y'all. It's rude. Alright, what do we got here? Oh, I like this one. Y'all look, babe. It's got a hunting dog. Hunting dog. 19500 You know what this tells me? Huh? He was on some kind of list for these artists, and they automatically would always send him, send him the, that number. Because uh, I've known several collectors that that's what they would tell me. Looks so signed and numbered. This one, okay, this one does have a COA. I can't see it. Is it that same dog? Is it 190? One, yep, 190 over 500. Yeah, look, I got the... Hi, guys. Looks like... Type of you see that crackhead with all that art over there? That's what they're thinking. <laughs> Look. Oh yeah. Put it back in its envelope. All right, y'all. So look, we still got all that art. We got this art right here. Yep. Okay. Oh, these people are prints. They're not. They're boxes. boxes. Okay, check it out. I peeked in here. I'm gonna tell you, I saw antlers and a bunch of other stuff, like uh, stuff. pew pew cases, mm -hmm. stuff like that. But I'm not taking all this off till the next video.